If your saw blade is beginning to burn wood, or you have to force it through the wood, or you find it hard to follow a cut line, it's time for a blade change. It only takes a minute or two, so don't push it with a dull blade. First, unplug the saw. Then look to see if your saw has a spindle lock button. It's usually located near the blade guard. The spindle lock keeps the motor shaft from spinning while you loosen the bolt that secures the blade. Press the spindle lock in while you turn the blade until you feel it engage. You'll know because the blade won't turn. Now loosen the bolt by turning it. Counterclockwise if the blade is on the right or clockwise if the blade is on the left. Unscrew the bolt and remove it and the washer if there is one. Now pull the lower blade guard out of the way and remove the blade. If your saw doesn't have a spindle lock, just push the blade down into a piece of wood to hold it while you loosen the bolt. The most important thing to know is to face the teeth in the right direction, pointing up at the front of the saw. There are arrows on the blade and on the blade guard to help with this. Face the arrows in the same direction. Now reinstall the bolt and washer and snug it up. That's all there is to changing a saw blade, so don't hesitate to change yours if it gets dull.